Welcome back, Whippersnappers. This is Gramps. We are in Shapes to the demo. And just have two little shape challenges left, and I thought we would knock at least one of them out. I did a thing. Let me zoom out a bit. Yeah, I deleted everything. I literally... I went through, I deleted everything except our blueprint machine. And that I... I spiced it up to get a full belt in. Got a little bit more than a full belt. And yeah, so there you go. How do you like that? We didn't really need anything that we had, so I just thought, what the heck? All right, let's look at these two shapes that we've got. Um, that's four layers. I think they're both four layers. Oh, no, this one's only three layers. But it's a little bit more complex. I think let's just tackle this guy. So we've got on the bottom layer, we've got two spikies and a rectangle. And a, uh, a pin. So I think we can do that. Do me a favor, if you're enjoying this, uh, give it a like and subscribe. And if you want to go wild, ring the bell once the game releases we are going to play it we're going to really go through the whole thing for reals i need to figure out how to um unpin is it there okay there we go so we can pin this one okay so let's see what we've got and again we are not adding color to anything we're not painting so we're gonna have to use this for blue and this for red so we only have one source for blue spikes and that is these guys over here and there's also a, a square attached to it so we basically need to take these and double up the spikes and then we need two squares so i think maybe what we'll do is just well i don't know we've, we've got the squares here and actually, on this one, yeah, see, we've got one layer where we're just going to need the um, the square attached to the spiky in the same way that it is here, just without the uh, the circle bit. So that's okay. So I think we're just going to take one of them then. Let's just do one. I also learned that you could hit the space bar to zip back and forth between space and non-space view. So that's kind of cool. All right, let's see what we've got going here. Let's just pull one out. And what if we were to cut it? What would we end up with? Yep, we've got a spike. And then if we were to cut this now we've got to rotate it first. And cut that. Okay. And then we can trash the circle. Don't need that. So. That's good. That's what we want. So that gives us one square one blue square and a one one spike so we're gonna need two of these for every one of these which is okay because then we you know obviously we'll get them at a one to one race ratio we can use that other one for the top uh, layer here okay then we just need to piece these all together so we'll get those going okay so let's do this we're gonna cut you um <laughs> is it v oh <laughs> okay this is the hard part about going back and forth between um one and two 
is that it gets confusing because <laughs> they're not the same. And that's okay. All right. And we're going to get a full belt of those going on, or at least a more full belt. Okay. And for both of these, we want to give them a 180. So might as well do that here. Okay. I think let's do this. Let's take it from here and come up a layer. So get these all bundled up up here. And I'll paste a couple of those in. Okay. Good. I think that's going to work. Um, let's do a couple of those going in there. Why not? We'll do three going in. Then over here, we'll get three coming in to there. Okay, um, it's an uneven number. You know what? I think that's okay. Let's just run these off. Let's go up here. And we'll take one of these and give it a 180 spin. Yeah, we probably should combine those um, okay I'm going to go back and put this 180 down here come up here all right oops Two, three, let's do five. Run those in, <clears throat> and then run those in. That's going to give us those, which we just need to combine with this. And I'm going to take this and run it up there. So those will be connected. I'm just going to work on just doing these guys right now. And so, yeah, let's do this. Does that cause issues? No, that works. That's weird though. Okay. Okay. So that gets those together. Then we just need to give it a pin. Put a pin in it. And the pin goes in the upper right. So that means there's going to be more rotating going on. Which is annoying because then we're going to have to re-rotate it back. Sure, why not? Why not get it all done in one 
space. All right. Okay, now let me re rotate that. Excellent. So that's looking good. Next, um, I want that little red red guy. And over here we've got our red. And look at that. That's the one we want. Exactly. So let's do this. And I'm just going to mine those. Can go off this way. I don't know where to. All right, up to that first bright one. And then, where's our hub? Ah, right there. It's right there. Okay, so to there. Excellent, perfect. And I'm just going to bring that out here, put that on the outside track. That's going to come in at the top here. These guys, let's do them coming in at the top as well. And then this is just a simple stack. And this on the bottom, this on top. So that's nice and easy. Look at that. Is that right? That is totally not right. So we need to give these a 180. Yeah, that will do. And we are going to feed those into the trash. for the time being, just to get them all cleared out. What happened here? Why have you stopped? <clears throat> ah, well, not because of that. Um, mm, <laughs> okay, it has stopped because we're doing too much, so we're jamming up the system. That's not good. So we've got too many squares. And yeah, I think we need to um, mine these at ratio as well. So if we do this, we're basically just creating two spikies and one square for right now, then that's, I think, going to open it up and, and it should keep going. It's going to be slow. But that's okay. Again, we only need to make 100 of these. So, you know, that's in the real game. You're going to have to make, you know, thousands of these or X number per second which is all 
wondrous. Okay, but that's looking good. I'm happy with that. For now, we'll double check in on it. So then we have the the half the little um, sundial sundial. How about that? The sundial and the um, combined with a with a square. So that's what we can do with that that extra square. Here's a little sundial shape. And again, we could cut it all up, but let's let's take advantage of what we've got going here instead. And we'll do that right up above here. Yeah, we'll just aim for that. Okay. And that's the correct orientation. We're getting lucky on that. So we're going to space belt these up to here. And then bring them out over here. All right, will that work? So if we had three layers, we could um, bring these up and over, which would be good. I think that, is that looking right now? For the first two, yeah, I think that's looking right. Yep, that's good. Okay, so this is good for now. It can, don't need to delete them anymore. Yeah, I think actually we need to cut this by one. And we'll bring it in to here. And then we'll loop it in and we'll do our final. Um, comp oh, no, wait a second. We need these combined with those blues. All right, let's do this. I'm going to change this. I'm going to come up and go one more. Um, yeah, bring them up here. And these ones bring like so. All right. So basically what I'm going to do is now I'm going to take every other one and send it up that way. So that means we can open this up again. So this was a quarter into a cut into a half a 180 and go in there and then add a trash can. Okay. So I think that's going to open this up um, to work. Then we need to just mine these. I don't think we actually started mining them. And I'll have them come in up on the right. Oops. And yep, those are going. So these are going to come out here. And we need to stack these in no particular order. So I'm just going to go ahead and put these on the bottom and these up top. I'm going to send them out this way. How 
Let's see if we can do this. I don't even know if we can. But what happens if we do that? Is there a input for these? No, there is not. So that's not going to work. Uh, that'd be cool if you could kind of piggyback them in. All right, so instead, we need to change this. Uh, no, we don't. Sorry. Sorry about that, friend. So it's going to be pretty. It's going to be ugly. But that's okay. Ugly is my middle name. Okay. And that's going to combine with these. We're just going to send over here. Is this right? Yeah. And then these are going to be on the top. Why is that not going? Oh, well, wait a second. Oh, look at that. Okay, so this is... This is not feeding them through because it's hitting the side of this. It doesn't pass through this. I thought it was going to create a tube. One of those tube guys there. Apparently not. So. <laughs> wow. Ugly. Again, three layers. This could be so much more beautiful. And it will be. It will be. All right, this one, uh, we do have an order. <laughs> so I'm going to bring this in. These guys are going on the bottom. This guy is going up top. I think that's our shape. Certainly looks like it. Okay. That little space bar is a nice, nice trick. See how much nicer it is without everything all clogged up. We're about to do that. So I'm also working on the. Um, I'm I'm doing a playthrough of Shapes One, and we're almost at tier. Uh, what is it? Tier six upgrades. So once we're there is going to be, I'm just going to delete almost everything. So if you want to come in and live in the past, please join us for those as well. It's fun playing it though. I haven't played it in a while. Okay. Those are feeding in very slowly. But that's okay. Again, you know, with with the shapes, it's just sort of take your time, look at you know, find find the best starting point, find the best resources to go with to start off with, and you know, distance doesn't really matter. It kind of does a little bit, but not really, because it's just eventually just gonna get all built up. And if, if you've got full belts of everything, then it really doesn't matter. Obviously, we don't. The thing that's holding us up is the blue squares. So, what I could do... But again, by the time I do this, we're probably going to be pretty much at um, 
our our uh, limit here. So look, if we do this and uh, oops, give it a half turn. If I just put trash can there, put a cutter here, trash can here. that work? No. So come here, go down. There we are. So that's just going to feed extra squares into the into the mix at the cost of just deleting. I mean, you know, no actual cost, but uh, yeah, we're deleting all these extra bits and pieces here. So. Yeah, see, then these are going to back up, and it's just going to start putting them all up that way. So look, we're already at 90. <laughs> these. So the time it took me to do that, there's no way those are going to catch up to this by the time this all clears out. But that's it. That's shape challenge number three. Why did I do three instead of two? It would have made so much more sense. That's okay. You know what? I'm good enough, and I'm smart enough. I just wanted to say it's just because this one's four layers, and I wanted to save that for last. So this one has more pins. Ooh, look at this. Pins on top of pins. All right, gang. That's going to be it for today. Though this, we're going to um, keep this going. We're going to do at least one more video of this Shapes 2 series. So looking forward to it. And uh, still looking forward to no word yet on the actual release date, so we're still looking for that. And in the meantime, we are just shapesing along. Thank you so much for joining. This is Gramps, signing off.